Welcome back everyone. In today's video, we'll be going back in time and unboxing this incredible Hulk playset. The name of this set is Breakout Steel Body Trap Action Playset. And it comes with this steel body trap and a Hulk figure. And you can get a little closer look at what that looks like there. And our Hulk figure is inside. This is a Toy Biz playset figure set from 1997. I am super excited to add this new Hulk figure to our Hulk collection. This Hulk figure has an orange vest, purple shorts, and looks really awesome. Cannot wait to check that out. And here's the Breakout Steel Body Trap Action Playset. Looks like there's heavy duty techno trap details on it, uh, wrist grip handcuffs, headlock harness, and of course our figure. Here's some other figures and sets that we can collect. There's this really cool Raging Hulk. It's an eight inch posable figure. And I actually do have that one already, but it'd be really cool to unbox that again for everyone and show that figure. There's this incredible Hulk with breakout containment unit. That looks really cool. And there's some other really neat figures to collect. Oh, that's cool. Battle damaged Hulk. Definitely have to get that with the breakaway lab. It looks like there's a timer for breakout action. I've seen that with other Toy Biz Hulk play sets from around this time where you set the timer and then Hulk breaks out of the set. And another thing about this is this box is in super good condition. So I'm going to be really careful opening it. That way I don't damage the box because I think this box I'll actually keep and, and hold on to it just because it's in such nice condition. And it looks super awesome. Before I unbox this, I just wanted to show everyone this price tag, $4.97. So it has that vintage, old, like, 1990s price tag, this orange price tag. And it looks like it was probably on clearance or on sale at one time because they just didn't sell all of them. It's really interesting how these were clearance or on really big sales at one time because they just weren't selling. Now they've become a collectible collector item. Okay, so it looks like so far this was truly sealed. Everything was intact. The tape on the sides was intact too. I just untaped it and did that. So yeah, this is definitely being unboxed for the first time. I don't know about you, but when I unbox something like this, it's just for the first time, it's like unboxing a treasure. It's just super cool. All right, so there it is. The box is now empty. And we have this cardboard filler just to keep the set from moving around. And a first look at our Hulk figure. That is super awesome. So in the picture, it looked more like an orange vest, but it's uh, turned out to be more of a yellow vest. So I don't know if that was light or exposure to sun that turned it that way, or if it's just a, a variation or something. I don't know. But either way, it looks cool. And this is a new figure for our collection. Definitely is with the yellow vest that's torn, has these purple shorts and the Hulk boots. It looks like he broke out of the left boot there, which is interesting. All right, we'll set that aside and our set is in here. Usually I just rip the packages open, but this one I'm gonna take my time a little bit more and kind of gently unbox it. That way we can preserve the packaging as best as possible. There's the set. And there we go. This empty inside now. I'll set that aside. That way I can, if I want to store it in the box, I can. Which I'm not sure if I'll store it in the box or just keep it separate like this. Or keep it out for display. Because it just looks so cool. That is awesome. That is really cool. So I'll give everyone a look around this set here. It's some kind of, I don't know what that was. Something kind of coming out of the plastic there. There we go. Almost looks like fur or something. I don't know what that is. Interesting. Okay, so there's that. And then we'll open this. And I'll gently open this too so I don't wreck the bag. Or at least wreck it too much. Okay, we didn't even need scissors for that, so that's cool. And we'll take this out of the bag. Wow, this is awesome. Okay, so I don't think we need to look at instructions here. This should probably just go like this. So we can snap that into place, and then this part can go here, and then this part goes down. Yeah, there we go. So pretty simple how it works. 
Here's a look at our Hulk figure out of the package, and he looks super awesome and super strong as usual. I like that yellow torn vest that he has with the purple shorts with this boot where he's, his feet are coming out of the boot. I think that looks super cool. And I really like collecting and getting old sets. Like I, I like everything to do with toys, the old stuff, the new stuff, but there's just so many different things out there to collect and I think this is really cool. So there is this on the back we can press here and his arms should go up. Let's give that a try. Okay, so it looks like his left arm just went up and now his right one when I put it up. But let's see if we can get them both to go up at the same time. I think that's how it should work. Okay, so we got the left arm to go up. It looks like this right arm wants to go up, but it's just, it's not exactly going up. And it might be because of the age of the toy. I mean, this is from 1997. It's been in the package the entire time. But I still think he might be able to break out of the play set. Let's take a closer look at the steel body trap before we put Hulk in it. So it looks like this is the heavy duty techno trap and it does show all the details there which there's a lot of them. And it does look like it's super powerful and strong. And there's the back of it. it looks like this is the timer. Yeah. I'm not sure if the timer will work but we'll give it a try in a little bit. So again, the other side, you can see all the details. And then on the front, we have these wrist grip handcuffs, which are interesting. Kind of moves a little bit. I Maybe mean, we kind of need to move things around a little bit just because it hasn't been moved in such a long time. And of course, we have this headlock harness right here also. Let's put Hulk on the steel body trap. So we'll put him right here on the platform and press down. This should lock into place, which it just did. And next what we'll do is move this timer over. And it looks like it kind of works. So with these timers over age and a long period of time, they'll either not work at all or they'll work really well or somewhere in the middle. And I think this one is somewhere in the middle. It's not completely not working. So it's like right in the middle. Okay, that kind of stopped it a little bit. And that's what we wanted to do is to stop the timer a little bit that way. We can... Okay, it just went off on its own. We'll redo that. But you, you kind of see how it's going to work a little bit now. But we'll redo some of the beginning steps here, pressing Hulk down. Move the timer over a little bit. So yeah, if the timer isn't locked in place, these don't close, so it has to be moved over a little bit. Okay, I think it should work this time. Get Hulk's arms in place. I have a feeling this will work this time. Or at least I hope it will. Okay, and let's put this carefully over Hulk. I'm sure this worked much better when it first came out, like many, many years ago in 1997. Okay, so there it is with Hulk inside that steel body trap. We'll get a look all the way around. All right, here it goes everyone. Let's watch Hulk break out of here. That was really awesome. Let's try that again. All right, so let's get this set up and there we go. That's just where we need it, we'll press this down. Do this kind of gently so that timer won't go off before it's supposed to. Okay, that's locked into place. Okay, so far this is going really well and smooth. Oh no, is this going to close? Okay, we're having a little problem with this closing. All right, we got it everyone ready to go again. We'll get this timer going. Well, that was awesome. I could do this so many more times. All right, let's do it one more time. We just got it one more time to make it three times because this is so awesome. Now that's working a little bit better. Get that timer set and let's put this here. 
push Hulk down. So we're getting the hang of this working a lot quicker now. There it goes. All right, the last part, let's see if this works. Okay, so far so good, we're doing it. Okay, so for some reason, okay, there we go, we got it. We're good to go. All right, let's get at a different angle. We'll see it from this side now. Okay, that time Hulk didn't like fly up in there. Did I not press down? Maybe I didn't press down. So that means we're gonna do it another time. As you can see, we're having a ton of fun with this here. Okay, we gotta get Hulk to fly out of the steel body trap. Okay, this part. This is the part that's not been working so well, so. Oh, there we go. I think it just needed to be pushed in a little bit more. Okay, we got it and we are ready to go again. All right, Hulk didn't fly out of the trap this time, but at least he broke out. So I'll move this aside, Hulk jumps out. There we go. And now Hulk is ready to go. All right, well, that is it for today's video. I had a ton of fun unboxing this, and I hope you did too. Please remember to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.